Hello and welcome to another TCM video and I hope you guys are having a great day. I've gone against everything that I stand for and finally played the victims again. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I actually, I do love the victims. I felt the need, the urge to address the insanity that is the fighting meta. Particularly Choose Fight. Ever since it has been amended, it's become one of the most notorious perks in the game. It was a great perk to use before. And it's even better now. And I frequently find myself battling two family members beside one another with zero consequences. <clears throat> In my opinion, it's not enough. I should be able to take all three. <laughs> Personally, I think the stats and the functionality of the perks should be adjusted. And as you'll see in the games, the family are quite literally helpless when around the valve and the fuse. And if you ever use high proficiency, you can jump off the door, fight the family, get back on the door and complete two bars of the lockpicking minigame before they can even hit you. Again, it should be three bars. <laughs> Anyway, for the abilities, I am using increased duration, stamina hit recovery, and reduce damage. For the perks, of course, we're using Choose Fight to stun the family for five seconds longer. Empowered, so we regain health and stamina whenever we win a close encounter. And Jumpstart, so stamina consumption on dashing is reduced. For the attributes, I go 15 into toughness, 7 into endurance, and 10 into proficiency. The toughness is amazing for completing those inner objectives like Valve and Fuse, and if you're good at managing your stamina, you shouldn't need any more endurance. As for the proficiency, I just like 30 because it allows me to escape the basement quite quickly. The quicker I leave the base, the earlier I'm distracting the family so others can escape. But as I said earlier, you can exchange all the toughness for proficiency if you prefer unlocking those doors. And lastly, here is the skill tree. Please feel free to pause the video if you wish to copy my build. Well, that is all from me. Please like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the Choose Fight games. We're playing now. now. We are in on the gas station. We're going to be uh, trying to get some good Choose Fight value. Let's see if we can't get upstairs and punch some family members right in the face. Got another cr I've got another crumb on my desk, man. What's it doing there? Doesn't belong there. <laughs> right, let's get upstairs. We've got a sissy, Johnny, and a cook by the looks of things. It's going to be an interesting one. I like it when there's no leather face and I used to use fight because I just know I'm going to get value on every single family member. I never usually escape out of this exit, actually. I prefer going up the workshop because I get a good, like, eagle eye view on things. And there's no ladder. <laughs> you don't need a ladder to get up the workshop. Anyway, let's climb upstairs. Oh, smell my feet is sissing. God damn it. I want to smell your feet, sissy. There's a valve is there. There is, okay. Hopefully the valve is by the workshop, actually, because then hopefully I can get over there quite rapidly. It is not. Okay, well, that's time to cry then. If we can get some early pressure, some quick early pressure, we might be all right. Okay, I saw the cook pass. He's going to be padlocking that door not just there. Nice, okay. Well, I'll go over and crouch just here because he's locked an animation during that. Nice, okay. All right. So we know the valve is around the back of the house. Let's see what we can do here then. Any early pressure here would be great. Someone's, someone's only just come out of the basement. That's crazy. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can't do this yeah. quickly. Lovely. Let's fight Sissy as well. Again, if we could stun someone, I had a feeling she would have Spore Loser as well. That's savage for me. Well, it's more important that we open this real quick. We have put choose fight on her, so it's gonna be really rough. Damn kids. You wanna fight me as well, huh? Oh, yeah! Mm, you're that punk. Oh, Johnny's gonna have stamina there. That's unfortunate for him, isn't it? <laughs> Let's climb out. That's unfortunate for him. And Sissy's the only cruel gapper. Oh my god, Sissy, you need to hit Connie if you're gonna swing like that. <laughs> he was like constantly wailing everything. <laughs> He'll see me here for sure. He didn't see me. Oh, this is going to be... <laughs> They're all going over there. That's why I really enjoy slamming doors open. If I... Okay, I'll fight you here. No worries, man. Yeah. Spore loser again. Man, I hate spore loser with a passion. It's, it's a very strong per sissy perk. Right, let's keep uh, let's kind of keep this pressure up. Mm. We stunned her once there. We may even be able to uh, get a backstab on her. I don't think we'll make it in there in time, no, unfortunately. Oh no, definitely not. Not with old matey boy there. Because Johnny can't do anything here. <laughs> we distracted him so well here as well. Okay, let's run sissy round. All right then. All right. Okay. 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 Look at this. She can blow poison, but it, it, I, I think she's too late now, actually. Even if she blew poison, that wouldn't work. 
Nice. Oh my god, Cook's going downstairs. Sissy can chase me as much as she wants. She wouldn't she would never be able to get me. And other people are getting out during this during this period of time. Which is nice. Because she's got spore loser, what I might do is this. Yep. There it is. <laughs> that poor girl, man. If I had tenderizer, she'd be done. Uh, let's get this bad boy on again. Yeah. She's coming this direction for sure. That's fine. I actually hope she I actually hope she does this. I need to try and sneak attack her like that. Nice. That'll put her out of commission for a very long time. Oh, there's empty here. No, I'm, I'm all out of scraps. Where'd she go? Oh, she's still there. Okay. <laughs> she tried swinging with zeros. You have zero stamina when that happens, sissy. <laughs> Sasquatch, my girl. Someone died as well. We do need to find some bone scrap like ASAP right now. I'm going to come downstairs and grab some. Because it's so hard to fight family without any... Because uh, it's not possible to fight family unless you're Leland. Ah, come on. All we need to do now is just bash Sissy one more time. She was stunned for so long. Chew's fight is just insane, can I just say? <laughs> ah, Chew's fight is ridiculous. Two people are done. Wait, we need to get, we need to get out there before uh, it starts. Nice! Drift King, Drift King. What I'm going to do is I'm going to run her away. Okay, she's going to go back. She she seems like a person that will get off of it as soon as I run close. No? Okay, we'll wait a bit and then we'll stab her. There you go. She's done. We're out. We're out. He's, we got our ability too. Look how long she stands there. Watch. I'll watch. Alert. She's still stunned. <laughs> it's just absurd, man. It's just absurd. Even though we're out of stamina, we have uh, restore stamina on here, so we should be fine here. Anyways, but you see what I mean? Like, I can fight two or three members around... Or oh, one to two members around the uh, the valve. You really want to fight me, huh? Suff no suffocating grip. That's unfortunate for you, punk. Punky boy. Even if it was right on me, I could have just popped my ability. And I'd have got stamina when he hit me, so I'd have been able to make it regardless. But GG's, man. Really good game. Right, let's go. We're playing Anna, and we are in on Nancy's house. Let's grab some tool picks and some bone scraps. And then head upstairs as quickly as we possibly can. We want to be putting pressure... On those external objectives, allowing others to uh, escape. Fingers crossed, we can get to a valve location really quickly, and obviously locate the valve quick as well. I like to go for the valve in these areas. I really do. You know what? As well, so I don't waste the bone scraps upstairs. I'm gonna grab some down here as well. We wanna we're not trying to get as, keep as many bone scraps upstairs as possible. Mm, give me that. Man, I'm going to get really bad cramps in my arms eventually. I swear to God. I mean, if someone comes over here, this is a big waste of time for them. Them coming over into this area is a terrible waste of time. There's bone scraps there. And the valve's there. <gasps> this is like a perfect setup for us. I hit you setting up there. You know what? I'm going to take. I'm gonna do a bit of reconnaissance here. Johnny Hitchy. Yeah, nice. And Cook. Where's Cookie Boy? We're missing one other person, and that is Cook. You know what? I wouldn't usually do this, but I guess why not? We're going to get people on this, distract, you know, distracting them and stuff, so. Oh, go on, Leland. Run. Oh, my God. Did he just bash? <gasps> he just bashed Hitchy and then went straight for Johnny. That's crazy. Yeah. Okay, nice. We got Hitchy on us. Good, good, good. Hopefully, he'll go upstairs to try and stop us from getting out there. I would hope. Leland, you need to run, man. Leland might be dead here. No, okay. He's not dead. All right, nice. Someone's got to cover that area now. What is that trap? Look, oh, traps like this. Don't be traps what like this, because look. It's like, you know you know the trapper on DVD when people start to do stuff like that? It always makes me wonder. Okay, Hitchy's trapping the, the, the uh, generator just there. Nice. I think Johnny might just camp. You're goddamn right. It's smart. If he just camps, it's real smart. It's annoying because it means like... This area. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Nice. He's gone upstairs now. That's perfect timing. Oh, perfect timing. Yes. Bash this on quickly. Mm. Nice. We need to grab one more bone scrap at least. Lovely. That saves us getting it in the future. Right. Now, let's gatekeep it. Let's gatekeep it so no one can come over here. I need to pay attention and try and close encounter them early. Let's defend it. I will crouch, though. They may not even come to... Oh, look at Virginia doing that door. <laughs> wow. They've undone so many gates. <laughs> I'll, I'll close the counter Johnny here. No, 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 no. Yeah, look. <laughs> I didn't even need to close it. He tried running away from me. That just goes to show he knows how strong Chew's fight is. Look. 
The guy tried running away from me because he didn't want the heat. Oh my god, look at that. There's nothing this guy could do either. Look, he'll run over there because we stunned him early. He'll try it. But then we could stun him again here, I think. Just in time, maybe. Oh my god, that was a bad idea. Or was it? <laughs> mm. He's not hitting me. Come on, Johnny, you need to hit me here, man. That's it. Nice one, nice try. He's, he's out of stamina, okay. Is he coming in here? I don't think he is. We're gonna run around and do this. <laughs> Where'd they go? Nice, we'll go through. We can head back downstairs. We uh, head back down to safety. They Cook will scan me here, hopefully, and they'll see that I've gone downstairs into like a, a safer area. And they're wasting, the thing is, that area there, they're wasting so much of their time. They need to stand there now, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to go up and close encounter them both. They think they're going to stop me, but they're not. And the, uh, the best thing is the valve is pretty primed right now. Primed for the taking. So I'm going to head straight upstairs and uh, ideally I want to save a bit of stamina here. Let's go through. Nice. Let's fight Johnny. I knew he was going to do that. That's why I popped my ability early. Yeah. You that punk. Nice. It's a shame that the cook came at the worst time there. Mm. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We'll grab this as well, because I don't think he's going to try and chase try and chase us here. He's going to want to turn that off. Look how long he's stunned for, man. <laughs> and the cook's coming back down. So much distraction. So many distractions. They've not... You know what's ironic about this? They've not even turned on the, uh, the generator again. They've not even turned on the generator. I could literally just run upstairs, man. Ah, and he's doing it now. After all this time, eh? Johnny's going to be camping that. I'll tell you what we can do then. If he's just going to be sitting on that. We can go for a, for a, a lovely fuse play. Is there a fuse upstairs? Potentially? There is not. We just need to try and drag them away from the, the valve now. We fought enough. Well, I need to locate where the fuse is. Okay, the fuse is there. Good. Nice. We don't have any measure with Grandpa. I think this is like the most useless thing. Look, I could just do this. What are you going to do now, Cook? I could just go through here. Again, I want to be trying to get as much... As much pressure on me as possible. So running into a trap there is not really bad for me. Nice. We'll heal here too. And there you go, Johnny's left the area. We go back through now. It's not a good idea to leave the cook just there, man. Oh, Hitchy even removed his trap there. <laughs> Terrible idea. He should have. I thought he put down a trap here, but apparently not. Time to kick it off while Johnny's exploring that battery. Lovely. <laughs> Choose fight, man. I can fight like two members at once. It's unfortunate there's no bone pile just there. What I can go and do is uh, go turn this bad boy back on. No, it's only on red still. They're not. They're not covering it for long enough. You need to cover this longer, guys. Look. It's almost in the green as well. Oh, yeah? You want to fight me, do you? Nya! You want to fight me? Oh, Jolly Boy's coming down here. I'd watch out, man. He's coming for you. <laughs> Look, Pitchy's choose fight for so long, he can't even swing for Leland. He'll be able to now, though. Leland's got himself in a bit of a... Uh, yeah. I'm surprised Leland actually made that, to be honest. He got himself in a really bad situation. All right, let's go ahead and uh, grab another bone scrap just here. There. Lovely. We'll grab two more. And then by the time we get upstairs again, the valve should still be open and we, we should have our ability. Yeah, these guys can't do anything against us. <laughs> uh. Yeah, come on. Keep hitting me. Keep hitting me. Mm -hmm. Oh, stop it. You're hurting. You're hurting me. You're hurting me. Oh, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> GG's. GG's. We are playing Zana on the slaughterhouse. Let's try and escape. Punch some family members right in their throat muscles. And then beat the hell out of them. What have the, they got? Oh, they got the classic three. Hitchy, Cook, and Leather Boy. Let's go ahead and get a b bone, pa bone pick and a uh, tool, pick. tool pick as well. And we'll get upstairs. Okay, it's coming this direction. You know what, Leather Boy. I'd never lock the doors. Okay, Connie. Yeah, I need to sneak attack this man now. Because Connie's decided to, to be absolutely reckless. And run straight upstairs. <laughs> As Leatherface is right there. Like, I needed to do that. Otherwise, she's going to suffer big time. <laughs> what are you doing, Leather Boy? Just hanging around. What are you doing there, man? How you doing? 
If he opens that door again, I'm going to run through and stab him again. Hey, Virginia, open the door. Open the door. I'll go stab him. Open the door. <laughs> she actually, she's actually going to do it. <laughs> oh, you want to fight me, huh? I'll fight you right next to this. Run, Virginia. Get upstairs. <laughs> she blinded him as well. <laughs> That's just the ultimate disrespect, I feel like. Is the, uh, where's the valve? I need to try and find the valve. <laughs> that was the ultimate disrespect right there, I feel like. Right, let's run through. He's going to be scanning me here. 100%. Oh, someone put the valve on already. That's pretty crazy, no? Right, let's go ahead and run. It doesn't matter if he chases me here, to be honest. Because, uh... Watch this, watch this, watch this. Whoop! <laughs> it doesn't I'm distracting these guys so much by doing this. We can always prank it by cr crouching just here too. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> and now the uh look the generator is open. Why have they opened this door and not closed it? Did Hitchhiker come in? Was he that desperate to come and try and kill me? He must have been. Oh my god, okay. Let's go ahead and climb in here. Hopefully he won't notice. He's noticed, yeah. He's noticed 100%. They must be on comms together. <laughs> yeah, and the, the battery's been turned off too. Oh my god, we stalled for so long. And he didn't lock the door again. Oh my god, is this... This guy's ruthless, I swear to god. Like, he's, he just doesn't... Do you need to lock that door, man? <laughs> Why did he not lock the door? I mean, they know where I'm at now, so there's no point in trying to hide that. I feel like they could have done a lot better. Um, and not tried to murder me just there. That's a shame that that's, that's not the one that's been done. Yeah, I had a feeling that was going to disconnect. Yeah, there they all go again. Man, there's so many disconnects. <laughs> to be fair, that basement bow, it just goes to show how strong Choose Fight is. I incapacitated them for so long. And all it takes is one person to undo an area whilst we're messing around like that. And <laughs> that's what it takes. Nice. Anyway. Oh, well, GG's. We are going to be using Choose Fight to punch some family members right in square in the jaw. Who we got this time? Itchy and Johnny. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Cool beans. Right, let's grab some bone scraps and head upstairs. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to go at the workshop because I've, I thoroughly enjoy you going at the workshop when I'm going for Valve plays. You know? Don't tell me. Man, it's, I swear to God, whenever I try and do something, Leatherface is always there to ruin my plans, man. <laughs> God, I hate this person. <laughs> I hate Leatherface. I want to get upstairs ASAP as quickly as possible. Quickly as I can. Okay, of course he's coming around there. You genius. Is he going upstairs? No, he's coming around. Nice. He won't be able to see me just there, which is good. And then I can finally get up the workshop like I've always wanted to do. A lot of leather faces don't actually check around this area. As long as you hide around the corner, they don't actually check. But then again, you don't really want to waste too much time checking around the, the south tunnel. This, this, this door never gets opened. What about in your guys' games? Does this... Do I ever get open? I feel like it's neglected. But it's one of the strongest exits if you're going to go for uh, objectives. Because there's a fuse that's right just here. And there's also a valve that... Like, you can tell where the valve is going to spawn. Look, see? There's a valve that spawns right there. And you get a good view. When you go to collect the valve, you get a great view of... the uh, down by the side of the house. Don't tell me, Johnny's. Look, he knows I'm here. He's coming over. He can't do anything against me here. Again, if, I, if, if he wants to waste time here, I'm happy for that, man. He knows I'm here. And I want a valve. I want a valve -y valve. <laughs> yeah, I think he realized, like, him, if it was Hitchhiker, sure, you can chase it. But I, I, I don't think I would. I still don't think I would, even if I was Hitchy. Wow, you mobilized grandpa right there. <laughs> From around the back. There's usually a valve that we can get around here. Give me the valve now! No way is he coming down this way. I feel like Leatherface is always there to foil my plans, you know? The plan foiler. Uh, well, unbelievably, I actually took a grab all of these bloody 
Valve Shamir. Come on! Give me that. Is there a handle inside? I don't think both handles should be able to spawn together like that. I think that's kind of pointless. Then there should be some variety. Like a spacing. But that's probably just me being picky, I guess. Let's right, go put this on the valve and then start causing a uh, hassle for these guys. Someone's disconnected. I think it's because they've gotten out. Yep. <laughs> Jesus. Come on. Mm, mash that button. Oh, Drift King. We're drifting. We're doing the Snoop Dogg Drifter. Should be some bone scraps here. There is lovely, lovely, lovely. All right, let's go. Pick some of these bad boys up and head back over. We're going to be the protector of Valve. The Valve protector. To be fair, Johnny, you're not keeping me. I'll keep you, bro. I'll keep you, my guy. I'll keep you. <laughs> There's nothing these guys can do now. Especially because they're close to Captain Murley. Look how long he's going to stand there. Watch him. Watch how long. <laughs> it's ridiculous, man. This perk is so ever tuned. And if he wants to come and do it and actually turn it off, I can stab him in the back before he even, like, turns that bad boy off. And I think he knew that, so he's just given up on it. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Because we close encountered him earlier, it, it removes his... By the time he gets over there, his CC immunity will be removed, so... Okay. Well, GG's, I guess. GG's. That's a quick game. What the... Danny? There ain't no way Danny spawned in the same area that I have. What the... I don't think I've ever seen that before. All right, anyway, let's go ahead and get out get out of this awful basement that we definitely don't belong in. Oh my God, there's no toolboxes anywhere to be found. We're going to be jumping out that front window. They haven't actually got a hitchhiker. That's a really bad combo for them. They need a hitchy to be able to counter what I'm about to do, which is jump out the front window. Mm. We can stall so many people with Arno. It's absolutely crazy. Ah, oh, it's the bug. Okay. This bug has been in the game a while, actually. I've not ran into it, but I've heard about it. Where you spawn in the same place as someone else, you know, you don't get access to your ability. So, even though my plan is to jump out the front window, I won't, I won't be able to access my ability for the rest of the game. So, just great, right? I mean, she can... She didn't even set up her traps anywhere. What? And she's... Okay, I mean, I'm not going to need my ability to... Oh, no, they're all toasted now. I'm not even going to go for that because it's latched. I'm just going to go for this little crawl gap here. Lovely. <laughs> There's nothing they can do here now. They've just ruined themselves. That's so sad that I can't access my ability, though. I've got to admit, really rough. That, that poor Nancy tried, like, playing it. I don't know why she tried that at all. It's a really silly idea. <laughs> and she hit me, like, really... It's such a weak attack as well. They can actually access the fuse from where they are, just to let you guys know. They just need to go down uh, up the central staircase, but they just, I guess they're not choosing to, so let's get out of this game quickly. Nice one. Awesome. I'm out, that man. That poor girl. Yep, she DC'd. I'm out, man. Yeah, I thought as much. I mean, she let me out the basement. I'm out, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You go and make a mistake like that, and then... Disconnect, man. No, I wanted to actually play it. I wanted to actually try and struggle against these guys, but I think it's it's ever since Nancy messed up and they don't have a hitchhiker to trap those stairs. Well, GG's anyway, GG's.